I am the director of the Plasma Medicine Lab at the newly named Nyheim Plasma Institute, which is part of Drexel University. Plasma medicine is where plasma meets biological tissue. What we are doing to use plasmas for immunotherapy of tumors is to not use very high energies. Cancer cells are more sensitive to the effect of plasma than normal cells. So that means if a patient has a tumor, especially on the surface of their body, you could treat it with plasma and cancer cells will be destroyed before normal cells are affected. The beautiful thing in plasma medicine right now is we're showing that in a very non-invasive manner, we can actually treat diseases that are under the skin by stimulating the function of the immune system, which is the defense mechanism of our body. That's how our body naturally fights infections. And plasma medicine is now working in this arena that we can actually change the function of this immune system. So that means we're opening the doors to treating many different kinds of diseases. So I think this is where plasma is the number one choice as far as I'm concerned, because plasma actually directly stimulates immune cells rather than destroy them. This is such an interdisciplinary field. You know, you learn physics, which is so logical. You learn engineering, which is so practical. And then you come to biology, which is this big black box. But solving biological problems solves so many problems of humanities, whether it's agriculture or whether it's diseases. So I think this is a wonderful field and there is room for everybody and there is possibility to make major contributions. You can be a pure physicist and be in plasma science or you could be a practical lab rat physicist and do wonderful things for pure physics. You can be a modeler and be in plasma if you, all you like is your computers. Even in biological sciences, you know, you can be a clinician and be in plasma medicine. So plasma medicine is so new that, you know, almost every day is exciting. I am hopeful that in my lifetime, I will see plasma being used in the clinic on a regular basis.